Hi, this is Steve Haas again, and in this video I'm going to tie together how SPF and DKIM work together and where to find them. So, in your cPanel account, you want to go to the email section and look around and you'll find what says authentication. Click on authentication, and if you don't automatically have DKIM and SPF enabled, then click the buttons to enable them. Once they're enabled, then you click the update button and you're good to go. From here, we're going to go back into the zone editor. So let's go back here, and as you can see, here's the zone editor. Again, if you don't see this in your cPanel, you'll need to contact your support for your web hosting account to have them add that. So we click the zone editor, and we click manage, and here you'll see all your records. So you can drill this down by just clicking text records since they're both text records. And you'll see here's your SPF and here's your domain default key, which is your DCAP right here. So that's where you'll find them. They're automatically generated once you've gone into your authentication and enabled them. Now, we'll also talk about DMARC in just a minute in more detail, but that's also where you enter your DMARC information. Because you're going to require, to be able to deliver successfully to the inboxes of most email providers, you're going to need all three, SPF, DKEM, and DMARC, properly configured and ready to go, to be able to send from your cPanel accounts and have any chance of being successful at hitting the inbox. So that's it for this video, and I'll see you in the next.